Any song anyone has desired? These are good desires. We have spiritual desires. Hare Krishna. Bodha Paramananda Abhimana Shunya Adama Parti Tari Vedan Adi Parti Tari Jare de Katare, Pate, 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 Ah, 
translation the noble lord nityananda is never angry for he is the personification of supreme transcendental bliss devoid of any concept of false ego nitai wonders about the town going from door to door in the residence of the fallen and uh, rich souls He freely distributes the gift of the Hari Nam Mahaman. He explains to whomever he sees while holding star between his teeth. He is purchased me by worshipping God. Mm -hmm. The universe, which is on the pillars, holds a boat on the ground, appearing like a golden golden mountain tumbling in the dust. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Any other song? You can ask it. Krishna, Prima Manhi, Radha, Radha, Prima, Thank you. 
Whoever, wherever we stopped, from there we can start reading. Narish, how are you ready? Thank you. 
आदो आदाति क्रियांदाघंजिते कलास पंडिते अनन्यधन्यधन्यपुंदराजकामेदे कदाकंदीशिहा अशेषाधी प्रभु चूर्णपूर्ण सौख्य सागरे कदा करीशी हम ृपाणी लताग्रलाोलोचनावलोकने मनोदमोहनाशिते सदा करीशी हम कृपा कटाक्ष भाजन सुवर्णमालिकंचितिखकंबुकंठजे श्रीसूत्र मंगली गुणा श्रीरंगदीप्तिदी सनोनीलकुंडला प्रसून गोचुंदे कदा करीशी हम कृपाकटाक्षन पुष्पमे खला गुणे प्रसस्तमन प्रसस्तरात्मक 
भवे तदा ब्रजेन्द्र सुनो मंडले सवेशन ोकहारिणी प्रसन्न वाक्रकंकजे निकुंदुविलासिनी ब्रजेन्द्र भान ब्रजेन्द्र सोनु संगीते कदा करीशन
ಮನೋಭೀಷ್ಟಾಪಿತೇ ಸ್ವಯಂ ರೂಪಾಧಿಕೈತ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಮುಖಂ ಕರೋತಿ ಪಂಗುಂಗಾಯತೆ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ಮಹಂ ವಂದೇ ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರೋ ದೀನ ತಾರಿಣ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಶ್ರೀ ಚೈತನ್ಯಶ್ವರ ನಮೋ ವಿಷ್ಣು ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪೃಷ್ಠಾಯ್ರೀಮತೆ ಭಕ್ತಿ ವೇದಾಂತ ಸ್ವಾಮಿ ನಮಸ್ತೆ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೌರವಾಯಿ ಪ್ರಚಾರಿಣೆ ನಿರ್ವಿಶೇಷಿ ಪಾಶ್ಚಾತ್ಯಂಚತತ್ವಕ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಭಕ್ತೂಪಸ್ವರೂಪಕ ಭಕ್ತಾವತಾರ ಭಕ್ತಾಖ್ಯಂ ನಮಿ ಭಕ್ತ ಶಕ್ತಿ we we'll discuss something about so do you know which month is going on it it is is also called Adik Mas. do you know why it is called Adik Mas? You were there okay. and we had the same discussion in the morning so okay. so do you know why it's called Adik Mas? extra month in the calendar uh, every three years something like that you get from so where is the extra month is it 30 months in this year so have you heard about this concept there is something called solar calendar and there is something called lunar calendar so how many days in a year in solar calendar how many of you are aware of adik mas then we will not discuss if you are not aware then this will be discussed 
not aware <laughs> not aware okay so how many days in a solar calendar how many days in a solar calendar how is solar calendar calculated oh in a year so how is solar calendar calculated one round earth will move around the sun earth takes one year to go around the sun yeah. and that takes how many days 365 one fourth 365 days almost and since it is one fourth extra after four years we get a leap day similar concept is there now how is lunar year calculated yeah. So, how is it calculated? How is the lunar year calculated? So, lunar year is 12 lunar months. One lunar month is one rotation of moon around the earth. Okay. One lunar month is one rotation of moon around earth. And that rotation of moon around earth, moon around earth takes 29 and a half days to rotate. And if you do 29 and a half into 12, 12 lunar months make one lunar year. So 29 and a half into 12 becomes. He said the answer now, she's capability. Okay. 354. All right. So lunar month is moon around Earth. That takes 29 and a half days. And if you take 12 lunar months, it becomes one lunar year. So that is how many days? 29 and a half into 12. That becomes 354 days. Okay. Are we good so far? Okay. Our, our entire Vedic calendar is based on lunar month. Okay. So Janmashmi this year is which day? What September? Six. When will be when will Janmashtami come next year? Three fifty-four days. Yeah. Three fifty-four days. So that will come to eleven days less than September sixth. So that will be August twenty-fifth or August twenty-sixth. Clear? And then the year after that. Janmashtami will be which day? So it's around August 16, August 15. Clear? Yes? Yes. Then the next day, when will be Janmashtami? August 16, again 354 days, it will become August 5th around. September 3rd, September 4th. Then again, it will be yeah. August. 25. Yeah. Then, and then. Clear? So, our, our entire calendar is based on lunar. For example, Janmashmi is 8th day from? Purnima. 8th day from Purnima. When is Radha Shmi? Eighth day from Amavasya. Then when is Nityan Taradashi? Three, two days after Ekadashi. Or uh, two days before Purnima. Or 13 days after Amavasya. You decide. But it is based on position of moon. Every, like, even our Acharyas Goswami's appearance, means appearance, everything is based on Tithi. The word Tithi means according to lunar eclipse. That's why we always keep on changing every year. Goes back, 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 back. So around 22 days variation will be there in any, in any um, event, any festival. So, Prabhu, what happens is 354 days, then 354 days. So, from solar rotation, 
we are now 22 days behind. Okay. After 12 months, we are 11 days behind. Lunar month. After 24 months, we are 24 days behind. 8 more months, now we are 30 days behind. So, 24 plus 8, 32. 32 months, Adik one month extra in lunar calendar. Solar calendar, January to December only. 12 months only. But if you see lunar calendar, then there is this. So everything behind that is pushed by a month. Whatever is supposed to come, it's pushed to September. Everything is pushed by a month. Then again goes back by 11 days, 11 days. And then 8 days. And then pushed by a month. Because eight months only, then push, pull, pull, push, pull, pull. So Titi keeps on changing. All right. Then another name for Adik Mas is also called Malamas. And why it's called Malamas, the name is those who know Hindi, then why it's called Malamas? Not useful. I mean, no, I mean, nobody does the association thing on that month. On that month. Okay. So, do you know who is the precise? When when does the lunar year starts? Ah, okay. March, April. First year is March, April. Then April, May. Then May, June. And why it is two, two years? Two, two months? Because from middle to middle and it keeps on varying. Clear? The first month is Chaitra. So these are all lunar months. When is the next month? And who is a presiding deity for Chaitra? You know, every month has a presiding deities. Every month has a presiding deity. Nine, nine parrots. No, no, no. Yeah. Um, so who is a presiding deity for the first month? You heard about the word presiding deities. So who is presiding deity for first month? His name is start from V. Yeah. <laughs> okay, one second. Immediate Immediate huh? Anyways, so the first month is Vishnu. Huh? The first month is Pratama. It was there? Yeah, it's in Wikipedia. Second. This one? Uh, yeah, Vishnu Madhusudhan. Presiding deity is for Luna. Yeah. It says okay. Titi. So Chaitra month presiding deity is Vishnu. Vaishakha is Madhusudhan. Jeshth is Trivikrama. Ashadha is Vamana. Shravan, Sridhar. Bhadrapada, Rishikesh. Ashwina, Padmanabha, Kartika, Damodara, Margasisha, Keshava, Pausha, Narayana, Magha, Madhava, Valguna, Govinda. Bas. We'll come to that. So, what are these 12 names? Huh? Whose names? Our name? Krishna's names? Whose names are these 12? Krishna's names? Krishna, when we do, we love to meet him. What are these 12 names? Who is Govinda here? Cowherd boy? Uh, this Govinda is Vishnu. These are all names of Vishnu. How many of you have done Achman in the temple? 
We have done Atman in temple. Cool Atman. Yeah. How many Om, Om, Om are there? How many names are there for Atman? 18? 31? How many names in the Atman? 12? 13? 13? 18? 13? 13? 6? 16? 15? थोड़ा आगे चलिए माता जी कह रहे क्यों टाइम वेस्ट कर रहे एक-एक करके काउंटिंग कर रही देखते हैं सबने गिनती आती है ना हाउ मेनी नेम्स आर देयर ड्यूरिंग आचमन 11 11 कौन सा आचमन की बात कर रहे फुल आचमन इन द टेंपल पुजारी रूम दैट यू हैड हाउ मेनी नेम्स आर देयर हाँ, both sides, up and down, total. हाँ, अभी कैलकुलेट किया क्या? Yeah, twenty four names. Where are these twenty four names coming from? Yeah, how many Vishnu's are there? अभी तो बोल रहे हैं चौबीस Vishnu. On what basis twenty four Vishnu's are there? So, so what happens with these four? So if you do permutation of four, what will be the number? Sixteen. Four into three into two into one. So the Correct. So twenty-four visions. Yahabe Sudarshana. तो यहाँ पे शंख आएगा, यहाँ पे चक्र आएगा, यहाँ पे गदा आएगा, चेंज करते रहो, कीप चेंजिंग। How many will come? Twenty four. Those are the twenty four names we chant during Achman. And among them, what is the last one in the Achman? Don't miss. Ah, Om Krishna Namah. And who is that Krishna referred to? Narayan. One of the one particular combination of these four is Krishna. One particular is Govinda. So these are 24 names of Vishnu. And these are the 12 names which are presiding deities for 12 months. Any questions so far? Good. Why is Why? Why the name of Vishnu? It's coming in from Shastra Babaji. <laughs> Well, this is from teachings of Lord Chaitanya Prabhu. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's teachings, he says, if you, there are 24, there are unlimited, 24 prominent Vakunta planets, and they are based on, in which hand, what is the combination of the four symbols? And they all have different, different names. And then he gives all these notes. And they all have these, all these are all presiding deities. They all cover different parts of the body. So based on that, we give protection. It's called Narayan Kavacha to the whole body through chanting the names of different places. Half Achman only, Keshavai, Narayana, Madhavai, Govinda. So, <clears throat> no, there is Shri Dharai, there is Shri Dharai, Shri Dharai, hai. Uh, Krishna, Shri Dharai, hai. Trivikrai hai, Trivikrai nahi hai. Adoksha jai nahi hai. Narsim hai nahi hai. Haan? Achyata hai nahi hai. Hum jhut nahi baling ko. Jum sach chavai baling. Alright? So there are 24 names total. And there are... Hai Prabhu? What is the difference between these names? These are 12 among those 24. So they have claimed 12 months. Okay. And this one month, which is Adik Mas, nobody is living that month. So, you know about Rashis? Rashi? How many Rashis are there? 12. On what basis the Rashis are collected? You know, how many people haven't heard about Rashi? I mean, this is not astrology discussion, but it's connected to Adik Mas. So, can you give, name one Rashi? Scorpion, Scorpion, Cancer, Cancer, huh? So these are different rashis. 
on what basis that 12 rashis ha uh, sun's movement no sun's movement so in this particular adhik mass there is no rashi that comes no sun changes from one rashi to another so that's why there are 12 rashis मंथ नो पायस एक्टिविटी आर डन जैसे कि यू गो टू एस्ट्रोलॉजर फॉर योर सन्स मैरिज एनी बडी सन अबाउट टू गेट मैरिड नोट इज अबाउट टू गेट एनी बडी डॉटर्स नॉट इन टू स्मॉल गेट सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू गो फॉर योर डॉटर्स मैरिज वट विल एस्ट्रोलॉजर से एवरीथिंग इज डार्क एवरीथिंग इज डार्क नो तिथि नो गो तिथि इन दिस मंथ कम लेटर You want to buy a house? You go to astrologer. They say the whole month is dark. No auspicious activities can be done in this month. That's why Brahmana call this month as Malamas. Means nothing good is nothing good is done in this month. No presiding deity of this month. No Rashi in this month. Why it's Adi Mas? So this month is crying. <laughs> okay. Every month is like condemning this month. Why? Because good for nothing. In every month, we have some auspicious days. This month, whole month is black. No pious activity. You do something. Agni hota hi aage. Anything you do, very virtuous. Nothing works in this month. All the time we go close the ears in this month. Like no good day in this month. So just postpone it for a month. Na? <laughs> you know, people will say for their daughter's marriage. मला मास इज कमिंग अभी कराओ नहीं तो रुकना पड़ेगा देन वी नो दैट शी वेंट टू कृष्णा एंड शी सेड आई एम कंडेम फ्रॉम ऑल डिफरेंट एंगल्स आई एम आई हैव कम टू बिकम योर शरणागत टू टेक शेल्टर ऑफ यू वाइल क्राइंग देन कृष्णा सेज आई विल गिव यू द क्वालिटी ऑफ माय ओन जनरली इन इन सेकंड्स या नाउ आई थिंक वी यूज द टू सेटमोस अभी आ रहे अभी अभी आप एक स्टेप आ गए अभी वो कृष्णा के पास गई है ना अभी पोटेंसी आ जाएगा बिफोर शी वेंट टू कृष्णा शी वॉज लाइक दैट सर शी वेंट टू कृष्णा शी सेड आई हैव टेकन योर शेल्टर प्लीज शी वॉज क्राइंग नॉट शी वॉज नॉट स्पीकिंग लाइक आई एम स्पीकिंग अधिक मास यू नो एवरी मंथ हैज अ प्रिसाइडिंग लाइक किसका मास है जैसे मदर अर्थ माउंटेन्स एंड रिवर्स एंड तो वैसे मंथ महीनों का भी रहता है सो शी वेंट टू नारायण नारायण टू घर टू कृष्णा एंड शी प्रेड दैट प्लीज शो योर शेल्टर टू मी देन ही सेज आई विल क्लेम यू सो देन द प्रिसाइडिंग डेटी फॉर दिस मंथ बिकम्स पुरुषोत्तम ऑल द ट्वेल्व मंथ नारायण दिस मंथ कृष्णा क्लेम सो यू सी ट्वेल्व नेम्स ऑफ विष्णु वन इज कृष्ण So he says, "I will give you the same potency as myself." So that's why this month is said as there are two Vedic versions. Padma Purana says one thousand times more beneficial than Kartik. Bhakti Vinod Thakur, Sarsai Thakur wrote article. They say sixteen times more beneficial than Kartik. Jo bhi mano, at least sixteen times. Wo bhi achha hai, right? Sixteen times more beneficial than Kartik. So usme jo bhi bhakti karenge na, wo hi us thi ka growth hoga. और कोई भी काम करोगे ना फायदा नहीं सो दैट्स व्हाई इस महीने क्या करो घर बैठो खाली भक्ति करो तो कोई भी काम को फायदा नहीं होगा और एक और वन मोर बेनिडिक्शन इन दिस मंथ वर्शिपिंग कृष्णा इन दिस मंथ विल फ्री यू फ्रॉम ऑल पास्ट ऑफेंसेस एनी ऑफेंस कमिटेड इन दिस मंथ कृष्णा नलिफाइज कृष्णा डज नॉट कंसिडर इट That's why it's very easy to grow in our Krishna consciousness in this month. So, well, if we have committed lot of offenses, then like should my get a gift? 
then we should wait for this one to nullify. <laughs> All right, are we good? Any question on Adi Pass? Why is the name Purushottam? Purushottam because Krishna's name is Purushottam. So Krishna gave Mala Mas or Adik Mas his own name. So from then onwards, he is called by the name Purushottam. Govinda is also Krishna's name, right? Govinda here refers to Narayan Prabhu. So, uh, based on four positions of the four symbols of Lord Vishnu, one permutation and that Vishnu name is also Govinda. There is one such personality whose name is Krishna. But Govinda is name also name of cowherd boy. One who gives pleasure to cow. Or uh, Krishna is like supreme personality of God. But here it does not refer to him. It is expansion of Narayana. Which Vishnu is referring to? Oh, those three Vishnu are in the material world. These Vishnu are Nekunta planets. Those are like creation and maintenance of the universe. They are within material existence. Those are different because the planets they own. Anything else? Anybody left the body because, like, we do our fingers are based on TV, right? So, like, how do we do them? Very complex. I don't know the answers. Very complex. Is my idea, can I put most of the bhakti karo? Bhakti put some of the I guess. So, I guess I'm done. You can, how will you calculate? This city will come after three years only. Anybody? But in this month, I mean, according to solar calendar, you can yeah. say, but according to Tethi, it will come after three, three months. This Ekadashi, today is what is the name of Ekadashi today? Parama Ekadashi. When this Ekadashi will come again? This is also called, that's why it's called leap year. But that leap day is according to solar calendar. This leap month is according to lunar calendar. These were extra Ekadashi. Okay. Solar calendar, which Patani Jalta Prabhu. Luna calendar, which Yogana, Tavapo de Kira. There is significance. Any significance? I think, like, my understanding, Prabhuji, is when they change, the form of the Lord changes. Ah, so different forms have different names. But he is unlimited in the Only 24 forms of Narayan holding four. Then there is Nasimha. Nasimha Tari is different. Narsimha Vishnu is different. He is half man, half lawyer. He is four headed Vishnu. Looks confusing, but he is different. These are 24 names of Vishnu. No, Krishna holds only fruit. Today only I was hearing. One person said, who is God? He said, whenever I go to any Devata, they're holding some kind of weapon. Krishna is the only one who holds only fruit. He destroys everything through his fruit only. Doesn't hold any weapon. Any, you know, either Lord Shiva has, you know, Trishul. Everyone has something, right? So, Shin Chakra, he doesn't hold. He just calls when needed. And when he kills, it's not Nandan and Krishna. It's Narayan Krishna. Our Nandan and Krishna does not hold any weapon. He's Lila Purushottam. He just performed past times. It's not Nandan and Krishna. It's Vasudev Krishna. He's the one who spoke Gita. He's the one who killed. Even when the, the Krishna who kills the demons within Golo Vrindava, is also known as another Krishna. Everything is within him, right? So he just calls out different aspect of him. Within Supreme Personality of Godhead, all the incarnations are there. So he is just... Nandan Krishna is just past time. So you have to decide where you want to go. Right? Or parts within past times. He is Lila Purusha. All right? This Krishna of 24, mm -hmm. yeah, he is expansion of Narayana. 
So this is very interesting. Sitan Mahaprabhu says unlimited Vakunta planets. Then he says 24 kinds of Vishnu. So that's all we know. <laughs> we all we have to go to somebody who says we less. <laughs> this is theoretical. Right? It's like it's a Vaikuntha. There is separate lot of Vaikuntha. Vaikuntha means spiritual world. Vaikuntha means no anxiety. Within Vaikuntha, unlimited spiritual planets. Yes, um, and these 24 visions, so many. And then on the top, there is going to Okay. Yes. Somebody was? Somebody wants to go to Vaikuntha. It's very confusing. They themselves may not know these things. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu told us these things, so we know. I don't think anybody knows this thing actually. Mahaprabhu philosophy is very detailed, right? Very deep actually. <laughs> Everybody knows this very good now. This very good now. All right, can we go to CC? Any other discussion on this? When we are dying, which form we go? Mm -hmm. Well, Vakunta planet, five kinds of liberations. I mean, four kinds. Same planet, same Apsarupya, Samipya, Sayujya, Shashti. So, any kind of liberation is possible. But Goloka, these are not there. It's just devotional service. How you look, it's very interesting. Goloka is very interesting. Hello? Okay, anything else? You have a question? Yeah. Anything else? Can you go to CC? I mean, 15 minutes, I'm going to study something. Okay? Come on. So, where did we go last week? We were at uh, which one? Pavan Sarovar to Hogya. Ah, Khadirvan. Lakshmi say, Lakshmi ji Angel. Here, right? This we did. Anybody behold the forest name Khadirvan, renowned throughout the universe. If one comes to Khadirvan, he can immediately be elevated to Vishnu Loka. Anyways, I don't know what to do. But I don't know what to do. Vishnu Loka. Yes. Who is next? Leading? Okay. Go ahead, bro. After it's all over. Nice. Chari Prabhu Reyes gets kind of this. No. Pan Rango in bro. Yes, bro. Yuga Tana Beti Pahan Gela Te Tasai Lakshmi Beti Emi Joka Padena after seeing the places of Lord Krishna, Arthan, Hari Chaitanya went to Desa Sai, where Sisa Lakshmi, and the recipient of all members. Then he went to Shishashai temple. Together we lead. Yate Sujata Charana Puru Hamstaneshu. Vita Shanae Priyada di Mahikar Kasheshu. Tena Tave Matasita Vyata Tena Kim Sui. Kurpa di Vir Brahmati Dhir Bhavada Yushamna. Anyone remember this verse? Very good. Last verse on the 
the comment the our acharyas have written maximum commentary on this verse in the entire chapter 31 chapter so somebody can read this oh dearly beloved your lotus feet is so soft that we place them gently on our breast fearing that your feet will be hurt our life rests on only on only in you our minds therefore are filled with anxiety that your tender feet might be wounded by the pebbles as you roam about on the forest path. So you said that Krishna's feet are very soft. Anything? If you Krishna will become red. They are thinking what will happen when he walks breath of God. Every part of his body is very soft. It is said that if you Embrace Krishna, he will melt like butter. Cannot understand it. <laughs> Cannot understand it. No. But this, this is to explain. When you go there and if you get a chance to, how are you, then you will understand it. You know, Krishna has a, a fragrance. It is a mixture of sandalwood, camphor, and aguru, agar. Mm -hmm. So when you go near Krishna, First of all, you will find back by the smell only, the fragrance of Krishna. Like Krishna, like all the senses are, are like pacified in front of Krishna. That when Krishna speaks something, the way Krishna smells, everything, the sight of Krishna, these are called uh, this. When we take Gayatri Mantra, we are doing preparation for Gayatri Mantra. The last mantra of Gayatri Mantra. Talks about this. What happens when you see Krishna? How many of you want to take Gayatri Mantras? How many of you have written exams? <laughs> <laughs> this is the hidden motive. <laughs> hey, Gayatri Mantras, you have exam. How will you write it? How will you write it? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Mahaprabhu, when he sees Lakshmi, na, he is remembering what Gopi sang. Oh. This is Mahaprabhu's mood. And if you see, uh, what are Gopis called by in Brahma Samhita? They are referred to as Lakshmis. Actually, the source of Lakshmis. Lakshmi Sahasra Satasam Brahma Sevya Manu. Govinda Mahi Purusha Tamahamata. Chinta Mani Prakara Satma Shakal Pradeshi. So this is like Lakshmi Sahasra means thousands. Lakshmi Sahasra Sata hundreds of thousands. Sata means hundred. Sahasra means thousand. Lakshmi Sahasra Sata Sam Brahma Sevya Mano. He is always being worshipped by hundreds and thousands of gopis. Govinda Mahi Purusha Tamahamata. You deserve it. So he's correct. Okay. So in which order are we going? Or just random? Random is also okay because not much time anyways. Okay. So this is Lakshmi Sahasra. Yamuna Pada Hani Badra Hani Vela. After that, Sikhi Tanka Mahaprabhu saw Sela, Kela Tirta, and then went to Gandhi Gavana. After crossing the Yamuna River, he went to Badra Hani. In the Bhakti, Krishna, it is said that Sri Krishna and Vendrava used to play Kela Kela Tirta with the cowherd boys. During the entire day, Mother Yashoda had to call them to take their baths and eat their lunch. Bhadrava is the forest that was mainly the playground of three Bhadrava. So, uh, anybody remembers what happened in Bhadrava? Or it's over now, Yatra is over soon. Mm -hmm. Did we go to Bhadra? We didn't go to Bhadra. Oh. Hmm. 
they went to bandir one shri one and mansal so bhadra one is playground of bhadra bhadra is the name of balde bala bhadra is called bala bhadra okay so then mahaprabhu went to bhadra one and then he went to shri one anybody will read Shrivana also called Shrivana is where Lakshmi Ji performs austerities. Why she performs austerities? Krishna's Rasa times. Krishna says, why you are not happy with Narayan? She says, don't play with me, my Lord. See, I am requesting you. She says, why? <laughs> then she does not play with Lakshmi Ji. But he doesn't give her intense. Why he doesn't give her intense? For that, you have to join Nectar of Devotion discussions of Bhakti Shastra. Profiting Bhakti Shastra because nobody is visible, I see, or nobody is there in Bhakti Shastra. <laughs> so, <clears throat> where did Krishna Mahaprabhu, Mahaprabhu went first? First. Huh? What happened in Vishangar? It's over, right? Past discussions. Now, Vishram Ghat. Everyone, please recall Vishram Ghat. Vishram Ghat. ऐसे ही याद हो जाएगा प्रभु जब जाओगे ना विश्राम घाट तब बताएगा हाँ बहुत बोला थे बहुत विश्राम घाट विश्राम घाट ये सुख में जाना मार्टिन विश्राम हाँ आ गया सर अब तो विदा मैंने भारत है ना उनको मथुरा क्यों भेजो वहाँ पे मथुरा में विच डिमंड विश्ना के लिए सिंपल मथुरा में उसी को ही भार and after Kamsa was killed, then his brothers, they attacked. And Balaram killed all of them. Then Krishna, Balaram, all the cowherd boys, they dragged their body to Vishram Ghat. Why they are dragging? Because people had so much fear that when they are dragging, everybody are seeing that they are actually dead. They have so much fear that even if we, even if he is dead, after three hours he can come back. Like he has so many mystic powers. So nobody is actually believing that he is dead. So Krishna has to do all this dancing to just make Mathra people understand that actually he is dead Baba, he is dead. I killed him. <laughs> then he performed last rites. Krishna himself performed of Kamsa. And then he took rest. That is called Vishram. It is nice if devotees go before Vrindavan, they go to Vishram. A very beautiful Arati of Yamuna there. We have a video of Yamuna Arati. 20,000 mosquitoes. <laughs> if you open your mouth, mosquitoes will enter. <laughs> Everywhere. When I was studying for the RT, at least 50 mosquitoes hitting at one time. Like, oh, this is real austerity. <laughs> Bed bro was there. He like, oh, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> that was his first cultural shock. First day he went to Yamuna Arti Misham with all the mosquitoes. He's like, you know, <laughs> these lotions are not working. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing works through this India. Welcome to Rita. <laughs> Welcome to Mathura. So that is Visham Ghat. Then after Mathura tour, then where did Mahaprabhu go? Uh, after Raya, yeah, he covered many temples, um, Jarmasthan, uh, and various ghats. Then he went to around. ले आएंगे उनको रात को हाँ तो कहाँ से चालू किया उन्होंने 
चलो वहां से चालू करो लास्ट डिस्कशन सो वेन आफ्टर राधा फोर्ड वेर डिडी गो Uh, all those are part of Govardhan. Govardhan, Hari Dev went to Mathura, came back in Hari Dev, and then where did he go? Only one. So then, ask your husband. Okay. So, huh? Ah, uh, Pawan Sarovar he went. From Govardhan, <clears throat> okay. So from Govardhan, you went to Nandagao. Okay. Anyways, Gokul Mahavan abhi aaye wo. Then he crossed. In between there is um, which one we. Which one? Agastya was killed. Last week. Khadir one. Bakar sir. Yeah. Then Khadir one, and then went to Bhadra one. Then went to Bhandir one, and from there he went to Loha one. From Loha one he went to Gokul Mahan. Can you see my cursor? No. Do you see Nandagao, Bhadra one, Bhandir one, Loha one, then Gokul Maha one, and from there he will go to Nanda. Okay. Okay. Clear. That's all. Okay. Somebody can read this. Upon seeing the place where the pin Arjuna tree had been broken by Sri Krishna, Sri Chaitanya Mahaprabhu was moved to pray. So, where is this place where twin Arjuna trees were broken? Gogul Nagar. And you go over now. <laughs> we went there and we didn't go to this place. Ukhal Bandes. Ukhal Bandes, where he was tied uh, uh, to a grinding board. To a grinding board. In front of Ukhal Band, there is uh, uh, Chorasi Khamba. Then, just next to Chorasi Khamba, there is a huge field. That's where Utana. Oh. <laughs> there are two Chorasi Khamba. One Chorasi Khamba is in front of Ukhalda. That is actual. Another one is made by. <laughs> Vallabhacharya. Both have Purna deities. Purna deity is there. But the in front of Pukhal Bandhan is the original. So inside that field, that is where all the demons were killed. All right. When Mahaprabhu saw that place, he was very much joyful. After grinding, the grinding water in the natural place was last no, yes, because grinding water binding is where in his home, right? In his home, she bound, and then where is Arjuna to Arjuna tree in the courtyard? So there, just makes sense. Okay, somebody can read this. Broken 
So he, Mahaprabhu came back after doing these tours. He came back to Mathura. This is where he met the Brahmana when Keshaji Mandir, when they were dancing the Brahmana song. And Mahaprabhu came back to the same location. Pandukin Prabhu, how are you doing? Okay. Okay. <laughs> And what is Akura Tirtha? You can understand. Inside. Then he came out and he saw their outside. Then he went inside and he pray, offered prayers to the deity inside. <laughs> he saw with Balram, he took the form of Adishesh. And Krishna took the form of Narayan. And he is like sleeping in a couch made of snake, Anantashish. Then he is offering prayers. And then you saw the chariot up. And he is seeing them inside and he is offering them inside water. <laughs> nice picture, right? <laughs> and this is where it is said that uh, Krishna remained. Krishna came to this point. After that, this Narayan, he took the form of that Krishna on the chariot and left. But Krishna never left beyond this point. This is the kind of boundary of Vrindavan. Be beyond this, Krishna never goes. Because Akura took bath here, it's also called Akura Tita. So Mahaprabhu came here and then he he will take many baths in the future here. He will spend a lot of time there, but he remained there. Okay. So anyone remember Prashkandana? Kund? Prashkandana Kund. Raise your hands. Prashkandana Kund. Kaliya Ghat? There was only parts? Yeah. Yamuna was there till that point. Now, no one. Now she is quarter kilometer only. We cannot see it because there is some shops. Just behind the shop, there is a moon. So it's like very, very close still. But like, I heard you went in flood, right? You went during flood, right? During flood. So Yamuna came there. <laughs> Yamuna came there. Kaliya got that. I was thinking, oh, I wanted to be there to see how Vrindavan was 5,000 years back. Now we go, only roads are visible. Yamuna is quarter of a kilometer. Close only. But Yamuna came all the way. That's how it was before. It was Yamuna was that much full actually. And if you see, it's a very good proof actually. Yamuna came there. Yamuna did not go other further side. She remained only there. You understand? So, the level are like this. You understand my point? How many understood what I am saying? No, but only one, two people understood. I think Prashara time is his time. <laughs> See, when flood came, Yamuna came only till Kaliya Ghat, Chir Ghat. And above that, Yamuna did not go. So, so they are at a level. Other, other side of Baki Bihari and those places are further up. So that's a proof that Yamuna walks still there. Because it is still, but we cannot see with our eyes. But then Yamuna came there, she gave a realization actually. She, that's how I was. And it was deep there. 
but there's nothing, no water beyond those area. Autos are going here and there on that side of the road. You know, there is this road also being to Vrindavan. And then this side, there is the other side which go to Lohi Bazaar, other places. They are running. Other autos, that road are there. This side flooded. So it means there are, there are gradations of bank of Yamuna. But now it's just like a city. Okay. And Prashkandana Chetra, Prashkandana Kund, Prashkandana Kund. Ah, so what? I mean, okay, they meet first time at this place, that is correct. How was Prashkandana Kund created? The Very good. Excellent. Uh, Krishna was cold after killing Kaliya. So he went on the top for some bomb. Then Radharani told Suryadev, Why Garam Karo Inko? So 12 sun gods came. And Krishna was very warm. This was very good. So sweat came from his body. 12 suns came and this feels very nice. So from that, water came down that hill and then formed a pond. And that is called Prashkandi Pond. Uh, now it's in, in vision. But Mahaprabhu ka time bit Krishna's Kavira Goswami, that was there. But now it disappeared. Many ponds have disappeared. This one of them. All right? Narish Prabhu, are you doing okay? Good. Ek do bar kar le. Lagta hai di kuch hua hai. Yes. So this is. Where is Dwarasa Dasa Ditya Tila in this picture? How many have been to Vrindavan? Vrindavan? Anyone remember seeing this? Ashim Mata, you remember this picture? Next time we go, you have to come with us. <laughs> See, I'm promoting something. <laughs> this is Madan Mohan Mandir. So, you see this one? On the left hand side, mm. this wall, mm. the holes, there are holes. Just behind that, there is a small where it's written by a red pen, actually. No name plate also. <laughs> this is a red pen, this is Dwadash Aditya Tila. Dwadash Aditya Tila. Aditya is Surya Devi. Dwadash is 12 suns. Tila means hill. So on the top, that time it was not such big red walls. This were made by this Arna Goswami Stein by that merchant. So he made. That time it was top of a hill and Krishna stood there and they all came and from there the sweat went down. And on what is right next to this? Right this side of Madan Mohan Mandir. Bhajan Kuti Rao? Ah, that is you see this wall on the right bottom behind this is the Samadhi of Sanatana Goswami. But we have to go from there and come all the way back and we come to this place. No, somehow they close it. No, until we have to know what is happening. We have to know what is happening. But it's close now. There is no way this side. So, what is just this side? Who have been to Vrindavan? Yeah. Tomorrow? Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Yamuna yeah. is this side. So what is on this side? Which side? Left side of this temple. Bolo Baki Bihari Lal Ki. Baki Bihari Mandir is there. First, there is the place where Advaita Charya found Badan Mohan. It's called Advaita Vat. And that road, just next to it is a road. Now they have closed this entry. I mean, now they have made the entry from Lohi Bajar side to Bhakti Vyari Mandir. Previously, you can still go, but many people were getting killed in Bhakti Vyari Mandir. So, government made that law a few months back. But on this side, after Advaita Vat, you go. And then there is Bhakti Bihari Mandir on that side. 
and just on this side, on that road, on this side is Radha Vallabh, and this side is Baki Bihari. These are some of the Goswami stands. We were there, right? We discovered. Okay, who will lead this? Dwarasa Aditya Haiti, Kesi Pirde Aila, Rasafali Deki, Prema Murchika Haila. After seeing the holy place called Raskandana, the Chaitanya Mahaprabhu went to Dwarasa Aditya. From there, he went to Kesi Pirda. And when he saw the place where the Rasa Dam had taken place, he immediately lost consciousness due to that particular. So, where is Kishi Tirtha? So, this is the road. Here is Madan Mohan Mandir. Next to it, road goes inside. So, inside is Bake Bihari and Radha Vallabha. If you keep going further, then you meet Yamuna. And Yamuna, Tat, is actually Kishi Tirtha. Kishi Bhai. Where Krishna ki Keshi Diva. And it is in the whole area where the Ras Dida happens. In the whole area is called Seva. So in Mahaprabhu saw that place, then he became unconscious. So we leave him unconscious for one week. <laughs> Absorbed. Then we wake him next week. All right? Shila Prabhupada. In between also many places that Mahaprabhu will go, Mahaprabhu will keep coming here. He spent maximum time here in Vrindavan. Next week. Next week. Next week. Vrindavan, yes. So, if you see the map, Mathula, Govardhan, then there is a place, Khadirwar, um, Govardhan, Nandagaon, Kamyavan, Khadirwan, Bhadravan, Bandirvan, Shrivan, Lohavan, Gokul Mahavan, Mathula. It's okay. But it doesn't exist. That is the first meeting place of Radha and Krishna. That. We don't even know where it used to exist. It just says on the left side. Nothing is there. So many construction constantly. Like they just put some neem and some eta and just gone. Right? It's okay. Prabhuji uh, Samataji, thank you very much. Uh, Thank you, Prabhuji. Uh, Dandavat Pranam. Dandavat Pranam. Hare Krishna. Thank you, Prabhuji. Dandavat Pranam. Hare Krishna. 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 Hare Krishna